is getting pre- Oh my God, who set you off to this? Here comes another Ben Davis phone tap on 99.7 DJX. So Gabby wrote to us, I want you to call my husband Jules and prank him. He's gotten me with pranks a few times, including scaring me big time on Halloween. It's time to get him back. Mm. Can you help? All right. Yes, we can. Greg texts in and says, been looking toward this phone tap since yesterday. Oh, wow. Here you go, and welcome to your phone tap, Jules. Hello. Hi, Jules. It's uh, Robert Hassenpepper. How are you? Um, I'm fine, thanks. And who is this again? Oh, well, you don't know me. I'm Robert Hassenpepper. I'm calling from the County Environmental Services Department. The county? You're with the county? Yes, sir, that is correct, and I'm in charge of the county's recycling and composting program. Oh, okay. And... Well, you see, uh, we have several sites around the county where people can bring their yard waste and their composting. Right, uh, but I don't, I'm sorry, I don't have anything right now that needs to be composted. Um, well, right, uh, well, we have set up a special composting site for today only, you see, where people can bring their old Halloween jack-o'-lanterns and dump those. Okay, I, I think that's great, but again, I don't, I don't have any old pumpkins, so. Right, Jules, well, here's the thing. We did a mailing to everybody in the county saying that today's the day that they can drop off their old pumpkins at our special drop-off location. Right, but, okay, so <laughs> I guess I'm just not... I, I'm not getting it. What's that have to do with me? Well, the damnedest thing happened. There was a misprint in the flyer, and the address was wrong. You see, our compost site is at 6765 Avenue, but the mailing said to bring your jack-o'-lanterns to 6765 Avenue. Uh-oh. Wait, hold on, hold on. That's my address. Well, na- That's my home address. Well, you see, now I'm calling. You're not at home right now, are you? No, I'm at work. Okay, thought so, because I'm in my car outside your house oh, right now. Wait, that's not my house. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What? What is happening? Well, Jules, you see, we were at our composting site this morning, ready for all these people to bring their old gourds and pumpkins and stuff, but nobody was showing up. And then, well, Barry, he noticed the misprint in our Barry. mailing and figured out that, well, voila, people are probably bringing them to 6765... Avenue instead of 6765 <laughs> Avenue. Oh, w- wait a second. R- what? Right. Well, what? well, what are you talking- uh, l- let me tell you, the good news is that the compost drive has been very successful. It's pretty early in the day, and your your driveway is already filling up with old pumpkins and things. Wait, wait, wait. hold on. Hold, just hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. You guys put my address on your thing, and now you're telling me people are showing up and just dumping their trash and pumpkins and, and whatever in my driveway? Oh, oh, no, sir. It is not trash. It is compost. Yeah, it's it's rotting pumpkins, right? Well, that is correct. Right. Yeah, then it's, that's, that's trash. Well, maybe this isn't the time to tell you, but you should know that composting is a wonderful and natural way of breaking down waste. It's also very eco-friendly. Look, I'm not feeling very eco-friendly at the moment. I just want to know what you plan to do to fix this and get all this garbage and stuff out of my driveway. Right. Well, uh, I wanted to first make you an offer and let you keep it all if you wanted to use it in your garden or as fertilizer. No. 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 I do not want piles of rotting pumpkins and other compost, whatever. Look. You need to figure out how you're going to get that out of there before I get home this afternoon. Okay, well. I'm not coming home to all this stuff in my driveway. Oh, uh, hang on just a minute. Here comes a couple more cars. Looks like they're dropping off their old jack-o'-lanterns. I, uh, I got to be honest. I'm excited by how well the drop-off is going. <laughs> there must be 300 old pumpkins here in your driveway. Why, why don't you it, stop sitting in your car? You know it's the wrong address. Get out and stop this. <laughs> Well, that that is a good point, sir. You're right. I guess it could be doing that. But honestly, the smell from the rotting pumpkins was so strong, I decided to stay here in my car. Look, this is totally insane. You know what? I'm coming home right now. I'll see you in a little bit. Well, I, you know, Jules, I just thought of something. We also have a free drop-off day for yard waste coming up this Saturday. I should probably look at our website and make sure we don't have your address listed for that one, too. Are you listening to yourself? I mean, what... What kind of incompetent department do you have there? Who's running this place? Oh, oh God. Well, 
Well, that kind of cut deep there, Jules. I don't think the name Colin is, is necessary. <laughs> listen, listen. You need to bring over a tractor, a truck. A, I don't care what. Just something and scoop all the stuff up before it rots anymore. Look, I'm coming home. I'm heading over there now, and I want my driveway cleaned up when I get there. Well, now, are you sure you don't want to keep any of the compost when the pumpkins break down? You know, it'll be really rich, beautiful, beautiful no. compost. No. I don't want any Are you of that. sure? Because your wife said she might want to start a garden in the backyard, and this stuff would be great for that. Oh, God. What are you talking about my wife? When did you talk to my wife? Well, Gabby's the one who wrote us uh, here with this idea. She wanted us to put you on 99.7 DJX to get you with this phone tap, Jules. Surprise! Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a second. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. So, nothing's in my... This is on the radio? Jules, it's Ben Davis from 99.7 DJX calling. And, uh, hey, congratulations. (laughs) Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, man. (sighs) I gotta calm down some. <laughs> okay. okay. You're getting heated, but Jules, you're saving the planet. Uh, that's right. You're Ash- saving the planet. Ashley texts in. I always question at times like this why I listen to the show, but then Ben redeems himself. I love y'all. Uh, well, here, there you go. That's your phone tap. <laughs> Could you imagine? Uh, 99.7 oh DJX. <laughs>